everybody, it is me, Feaser Bunny, and welcome back to episode 15 of Let's Play The Sims 4 Get To Work. Okay, guys, so as you guys can see, um, Kaylee is just pretty much taking care of our customer. She is ringing our first ever sale for today. Oh, and it looks like we have another sale. So it's time for Venus to get up. Yes, I did send them to go to sleep in just a little bit. Uh, pretty much just so they can get work and stuff. So yeah, now they can, <laughs> you know, they can literally get to work and ring up the customers that we have at the store and i'm really really happy that we're actually getting some sales tonight as well so yeah we're making two at a time so how awesome is that anyway um oh my goodness we're actually making three sales like consecutively how freaking awesome and i'm guessing there's so many people <laughs> there's so many people out there getting married because literally everybody's buying like wedding clothes and stuff okay jason has purchased an outfit for 219 simoleons fabulous okay let's just speed things up a little bit while the girls are taking care of our customers and stuff by the way you guys i'm recording this past midnight seriously though so if i sound freaking around ratchet that explains why i apologize in advance but yeah freaking ratchet i sound super crazy but whatever let's make sure that we're ringing up all the customers that we have and then um yeah make sure that nobody is you know being neglected here and stuff because literally we don't want to make we don't want to not make a sale if you guys get what i mean okay let's just restock our outfits here as well and check out which how many how much profit we earned tonight okay so outgoing costs 175 simones i guess we can have a little bit more yeah you know what i'm gonna have kaylee restock both outfits and you know what no i'm gonna have venus restock the other one actually so she is just gonna eat some yogurt because she got interrupted earlier when somebody like was ready to purchase something okay the boys they can pretty much just purchase um some cakes or something okay venus my dear you can restock this outfit now and just want to make sure that nobody else has um the notification that they're ready to purchase something yeah okay and thank you thank you for purchasing all the items and stuff okay kaylee yeah she's pretty much just gonna eat. and i'll actually just speed things up here a little bit just to do something and stuff you know just because pretty much the key here i always tell you guys this um i'm pretty sure i told you guys this in the previous episode anyway that the key to selling items in the sims 4 is just to make sure that your sim is have enough time in their shop open to have the customers fill up their bar because just let everybody take their time okay somebody is ready to purchase something how fabulous okay she's gonna ring up the customer even though she's really really uncomfortable she can do it and kaylee is going to bake something actually because if you guys remember in the last part we actually um we actually increased our baking skills so that's really really awesome actually french toast would be great to have what do you guys think should we have her breakfast scramble i guess she can make that i don't know i uh, literally not even baking though but you know it is part of the cooking skills so i guess she can also take advantage of that i guess okay and i just want to make sure that we're actually like making an income making an income here so we have outgoing costs is this like the net profit so does this mean that this is the amount of money that we earned already i'm not sure uh <laughs> employee salary restocking and purchase made from builds mode okay Ooh. so we have quite a bit of stuff to Ooh, what where's she going oh i'm guessing she's gonna go prepare that somewhere or something i don't know uh but the french toast is that even french toast breakfast scramble okay there we go let's set that up for sale as well and you know what i also need to toggle the sales tag as well so i can actually see what we're trying to sell here so i'm just gonna grab that and place that over here in the container and i think we might have to consider purchasing a brand new container as well because you guys can probably notice that um in the end purchase an outfit for 219 simoleons how fabulous literally though everybody is purchasing like clothing items and stuff it's you know nobody's paying attention to our freaking bakery and that's really really sad okay you know what yeah she's gonna restock that one outfit and then 
I'm gonna leave the rest. Um, you know, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna restock the other outfits just because I think that's gonna be a little bit too expensive. Plus, we have all men in in our store right now, so I'm guessing they're either interested in the menswear or the baked goods. <laughs> okay, so let's just be things. Oh my goodness, yes! I need to make sure that everybody at home is taking care of themselves um, because we are going to be following our scientist today, Galvin at work at his active work day so yeah really really exciting anyway let's just speed things up a little bit oh i'm waiting for every okay there we go what a choice what value okay you need to ring him up and then okay what is he okay i'm guessing he purchased that outfit over there and then um let's see here Ka kaylee she's not in a good mood right now so okay you know what she needs to ring up this customer like seriously though we're making so many sales like uh oh this is not good i just want to make sure that everybody is properly taken care of so let's just be things up a little bit how much profit did we make today actually because i think we're okay outgoing cost net profit yeah i think we have to make a little bit more money because yeah like seriously though we're spending so much money on restocking items and stuff that we can't make it simply by selling items so that's interesting <laughs> okay rodrigo what choice what value i'm ready to buy when you get a chance to ring me up oh my god i love how we're making our first sale to a child as well that's very very interesting so let's just make sure to ring him up as well i love how they're purchasing like some baked good goods and stuff how awesome is that and then yeah, pretty much just speed things up a little bit okay how are you doing with your sales and stuff ellie has purchased yes you guys yes i'm so happy um and our price markup is 400 i mean is 25 percent. so i'm considering of maybe increasing that and seeing like our customers reactions and stuff okay we have more people but which i think what i'm actually gonna do is just close the shop because i think we've sold enough items already or should i where's kaylee going she's waiting in line there's no line at the toilet like my dear girl what you doing girl okay there we go i love how she goes all the way there just to use the toilet actually you know what I think, like I said, it's probably time to just close the store. We did make quite a bit of money today. I just, I'm just a little bit nervous that we didn't make enough money and we actually lost money in the process. I don't know. Let's just beat things up a little bit. I actually think that we did lose some money, so that's, that might be not so good. Actually, you know what? Yes, what I'm actually going to do is just close the store because I don't think that we're going to have enough yeah, I don't think we're gonna have enough time to make a sale anyway because it's it's already early morning. Our grave our graveyard shift is almost over, so let's just close the store and send both of our Sims at home as well. Okay, let's see here. I do want to see the financial report, so I wait for that. Come on, Kaylee. Okay. Oh, okay. So restocking cost us seven hundred millions, which means that it already was taken into consideration um when it's showing me the net profit so that's really really cool okay so what i'm actually gonna do is just cut right into willow creek and i will see you guys there in just a second Alrighty, guys welcome home here in willow creek and i just want to make sure that everybody is properly taken care of i'm making my game pause because i don't want to make i don't want to waste any time uh taking care of the sims and stuff okay let's just make sure that everybody is or like the girls venus and Ka kaylee are going to sleep and then jay's is actually in a really really energetic mood right now you guys can see that he is pulling his groove or something like that okay gavin my dear boy oh you are cleaning the dishes how sweet okay and he actually needs to okay great now literally though we have one or two appliances or like fixtures broken so yeah literally every part that's all jace does is that repair everything and he's also tense so he needs to try to calm himself down in the mirror but i think he has work in three days oh my goodness who has work today okay i'm guessing we're gonna follow jace instead because he's the only one who has work so i'm guessing the pattern here is that we're gonna follow jace for two days we're gonna follow gavin or 
actually we're gonna fo follow maya for two days as well and then we're gonna follow gavin for two days as well uh because we did do jace's work two consecutive days already if you guys get what i mean okay so he just needs to socialize with somebody so you need to um make her laugh that is a really really effective thing inside joke and then um actually i want you to grab some dark something gonna grab a drink of this dark tea because you do have work in two hours as well okay gavin my dear boy has obtained two parts how awesome okay what else does he need to do actually you know what gavin you need to work out on your body i guess you know so i'm just gonna have him go jogging pretty much just to kind of actually try to maintain his body shape because i don't know i just don't want him to gain weight and stuff you guys get what i mean hashtag maintenance though okay and then maya you are going to just pretty much you know give medical advice i don't know <laughs> just pretty much socialize with him gossip with him i don't know maya is really really sexy i always say this like every oh, time i see her um, sure, or sure, probably i just Ready? miss you know ah. going to the hospital or something because it has been a while anyway we are going to yeah get to know him as well pretty much just befriend him make both of them close and then eventually we're gonna bring up like all the romantic interactions but for now yeah, i just want them to be close and stuff okay and then uh yeah so treat three patients what do we need to do we need to interrogate a suspect actually for jace here so we're probably going to be doing that on his work so just be things for a little bit and then um okay we do have okay our notification is probably going to come in a couple of seconds anyway so i'm just making sure that jace okay nothing too too crazy but yeah really really awesome you know what let me just pause that really quickly and just grab this plop that there Oopsie. Okay, so we are going to join Jason. I will see you guys when we are back at the police station. Alrighty, guys, we are back at the police station, and literally, we are going full on crazy. We're gonna make sure that Jace gets a promotion today, hopefully. So, first thing that we need to do is get to work and you know, find a suspect for Jace. So, literally, we need to interrogate a suspect. After arresting a suspect, you can interrogate blah blah blah. Do we have okay okay it makes sense it makes freaking sense okay so let me just explain to you guys the situation here in the last part we actually made our arrest we arrested rolando ruff and then when we got here to the police station for some reason he was not around i thought he escaped or i thought that we arrested the wrong person or i thought it was a glitch or something but it turns out that the game was just pretty much saving the situation for today I'm guessing yesterday or like in yesterday's part or something um, or yeah in the previous episode we did not have enough time to actually just interrogate him as well so this is really cool I like that system and I hope it's gonna consistently do it like that as well and so we're going to interrogate the suspect and Rolando Ruff and just pretty much make sure that he is the real suspects kid seriously though if we get the wrong guy that is so sad especially if you're like seriously facing life imprisonment if you're not guilty it's it's actually kind of crazy and there's also some people who literally are obviously guilty but they don't even get sentenced to anything they're still pronounced innocent and anyway i like to watch crime dramas and stuff like american justice or crime scene investigation like seriously though justice anyway let's just be things up a little bit while waiting for these two what are they waiting for okay there we go probably just loading some interactions and i just want to make sure that everybody at home is also you know what i'm gonna have him build Ooh, the, he doesn't have the option to build the skill yet i mean i want to just care for self you're also going to care for yourself as well you are going to care for self and you're also going to literally care for care for yourself as well but why does she have the option to build her skill anyway whatever okay let's see here so let's actually look at what this interrogation looks like from the other side of you know of the situation so you guys can see that we can literally spy on people while they're being interrogated and stuff Ooh, i want to take pictures of this Ooh, like that how cool um this this mirror though totally reminds me of like the thing in freaking cabin in the woods you guys get what i mean if you guys have seen that like 
one of the guys had like a mirror and or like a two-way mirror in his bedroom and he was like watching the girls changing and then the good thing is that he did reveal that before and he saw anything further i'm, I'm pretty sure no, none of you get what i'm talking about but anyway let's just speed things up a little bit while we're waiting for him to interrogate the suspect which by the way is already finished how awesome yes okay maybe we can even end our work day earlier today or something it's literally taking forever he's probably like not even admitting okay Ooh. oh my gosh i oh my gosh this is crazy i have interactions i think yeah i think i should probably have started this a while ago okay we need to um show crime pictures we also need to show the fingerprint evidence we also have to it, issue the witness statement and pretty much just try to get a confession here literally though i should have worked on this like since the very beginning uh oh okay he's he appears friendly he's fine well you know he's not necessarily like um yeah let's pretend to be friends or like i don't know maybe we can be bad or something i don't know what do you guys think intimidate ask him for a trick question and see how he reacts i think it's all about the psychology anyway you know and stuff like that i don't know i'm not gonna pretend like i know everything about um like police and stuff okay we are going to show crime picture bluff evidence no that's not good okay let's just show crime pictures again make sure that we make sure that he knows that we have seen him do the crime he has been caught red freaking handed okay let's see here so yeah we are interrogating him literally he's really really close to confessing okay let's see here evidence literally i think the best way to approach this is just to literally let the evidence talk and yeah and let's just do it one more time come on come on come on come on maybe we should try like um a different tactic i guess we are going to try to reveal the calling card the suspect appears to be guilty it's time to put this criminal behind freaking bars how awesome thank goodness we got like a freaking i mean thank goodness we got the right guy you know i was really really nervous but i did get a feeling that we got got the right guy so yes you guys less criminals i'm so happy okay rolando seems worried you should be like you should be criminals around the world should be worried because freaking jace is on patrol they should be scared they should be really scared i don't know why i'm talking like that but anyway okay so we are going to make sure that he is going to be locked behind bars okay we need to um lock him in cell so that he doesn't escape <laughs> i love how i'm getting really really fierce over this okay is he facing life or something i wish i knew what sentence he had like seriously he didn't even get a trial or something <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah we should probably get a trial or something i, I don't know i feel like just beating up a little bit we're literally wasting so much time and we have not even done anything i do want to do some good work today at least because i want to have a freaking promotion case closed nice work that's one more criminal off the streets unfortunately crime never sleeps and we have another case waiting for you get the assignment from the computer and get back out there okay you know what we need to talk to the chief for now um and tell her that chief we have um <laughs> bro hug okay where's the option to talk to chief more choices friendly um talk to chief and then let's actually just discuss case theories with him he should be like our best friend he looks like a best friend material actually totally totally looks like your generic guest best friend you know that's always around in parties and stuff are you having trouble with the writing on the wall calvin either get me some clearances or start looking for a new line of work what the hell why is she so mad like seriously we seriously we literally just finished taking care of a case like I don't know, and we got the suspect. Why is she so worked up about this?
Like seriously though, it would be so freaking awesome if she showed a little bit more appreciation for all the hard work that we do. Like upholding the peace here in freaking Willow Creek. She's so mean. Anyway, that was like my dramatic voice. Um, oh my god, I can literally feel my voice cracking. This is so freaking annoying. Okay, talk to the chief. Literally, we're not doing any work at all. So, okay, stop it. You are going to discuss case theories with your co-worker. Okay, there we go. And then what else do we need to do? Get a case assignment, of course. So let's just go to the nearest computer. Hopefully nobody's... Okay, over here, nobody's using it. So let's get a case assignment. Okay. And then hopefully this doesn't take a while because... Yeah. Oh my god, she broke the freaking computer. How hilarious is that? Okay, let's just speed things up a little bit. Why he gets a case assignment? And seriously though, I love his desktop wallpaper. <laughs> okay, let's just speed things up a little bit. I really do wish that we do some good work today, because I really, really want this freaking promotion. <sighs> okay. Oh my gosh, we're freaking not doing anything like at all. Okay, we need to cross-reference the database. Uh, like cross-reference the police database. Oopsie, what was that? Do you guys see that? was weird okay anyway let's do that again what's wrong with this freaking interaction okay cross-reference the freaking police database and we are going to see the crime witness reports oh my god that's so th that actually sounds very very technical okay so let's just be things up a little bit okay how much more time do we have one hour we are going to stay late <laughs> Just pretty much buy us a little bit more time to work on our performance and stuff like that. Okay, add clues to the crime map, of course. Ooh, start case map, I guess is what it should probably be telling me. I don't know. I love kind of the old school computers though, but this isn't necessarily like old school computers, but yeah. I'm used to everyone working on a laptop, and yeah, and I'm not used to seeing desktops and stuff like that. Okay, let's just speed things up a little bit. Come on, you can do it, okay. And then we need to add clues to that crime map. And then once you get a freaking, once you literally like fill this halfway, I'm gonna let you go to the toilet. Jace, my dear boy. And by the way, I've always wanted to point this out to you guys, but this map here, it looks very, very similar to the map of Manila, which is the city where I live. Manila, Philippines, you guys. Um, Mabuhay, anyway. Uh, yeah, that literally looks like my hometown or my home city. And then he just needs to use the toilet here really quickly. Like that. And you know what? Flush it first before you use it. Because that's like really, really gross. Okay, and then what else do we need to do? Okay, cross-reference the police database. And then, come on, you can use it. Okay. And he's really uncomfortable. So, yeah. And then, okay, over here we have a broken computer once again. What are these people doing? Like, they're literally, like, destroying property here. Okay. So, I'm panicking. <laughs> okay, there we go. Did she also break the computer? Are you freaking kidding me? Okay, we need to, um, get her out of the way. Yeah, so we need to pretty much just get her out of the way, and then let's actually more choices. Uh, what I'm get, I'm trying to look at like interactions that would require her to stand and stuff. Uh, cause I don't want to waste our time. Like, yeah, group activity. Uh, ask to cloud gaze. Yes, and we're totally gonna stood her up or stand her up or something, or leave her hanging. I don't know what just. I don't know what you guys say. Anyway, we seriously like need to get to work. Come on. Come on, Jace. We're, we don't have that much time. We literally like do not have that much time. Why is everything breaking? Is this like a thing? You guys, is this like some sort of thing? It's getting really, really creepy. Um. Okay, you know what? You are going to ask her to leave or something. Is, is that an option? I think my game is glitching out because seriously though, every freaking go away we're gonna be mean or we're gonna be rude or we're gonna just say that we have a little bit more important things to do other than her like facebooking and stuff okay come on jace come freaking on you you're taking such a long time okay and we need to cross reference the database okay cross reference the police database with some crime scene photos of course 
Uh, okay, I hope they don't fight. Uh oh, they're fighting. That's not good. I don't want to make. I don't want Jace to have like that many enemies and stuff. But he is working in freaking law enforcement. So you know, I'm guessing that. Yeah, we're probably gonna be making a lot of enemies. You know, butting heads with some Sims and stuff. Okay, let's just speed things up a little bit for Jace. There we go, and then let's see here. I really, really want to fill this up too. You know what? I think we can, um, yeah, I think we can fill this up like up to here or something. You can do this, Chase. You literally have like 30 more minutes. How long does it take to freaking fill the crime map? I don't think it's that long anyway. Okay, Jace's workday will end in an hour. Yes, we know. Okay, yes, we know. Okay. Whew, okay, now I think we're probably gonna get the promotion. I don't know. Um, but we do have a little bit more time. So I think, yeah, yeah, let's. Jace discovered something, something. Okay, whatever. Let's just grab the police database here really quickly and, um, make sure that we're also. Oh, come on, girl, get out of the way. Where we need to have some work done here uh okay let's just pause the game seriously though please tell me like nobody's using the other computer yeah oopsie i totally forgot that it was freaking broken See, ugh, so annoying can we just delete her or something because i really need to work and there's no option to like get her out of the way seriously um can we mean and then like pretend to fire oh there we go i did see the option to have her go away I guess so let's just be mean to her just send her to go away get away sheesh okay we literally have 10 minutes remaining until our workday ends so hurry up okay there we go and you need to browse the freaking police database come on Jace you can do this you can do this I don't know you guys see that that literally glitched out there for a second okay let's just speed things up a little bit Come on, Jace. What are you waiting for? We can do uh, so much more work. Oh, no. Oopsie. I got the wrong interaction. No. Cross-reference the police database. I mean, okay. Crime witness report. Oh, my God. Thank goodness. Oh, thank freaking goodness we got the freaking promotion. Okay. Jace did a good job today. The citizens of this community will surely appreciate his desire to protect and serve. Jace has been promoted to a detective. Yes. 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 I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Yes. Okay. He will now make an additional 16 simoleons per hour for a grand total of 57 per hour. He also received the following bonus. Unlocked no holds, barred windows, unlocked privacy glass, unlocked Jailbirds lament unlocked be prepared security gate unlocked brush metal double door and earned 300 simoleons his next shift is tuesday at 900 9 a.m and the money earned today is 369 simoleons how freaking awesome so actually you guys what i'm actually gonna do is pretty much just wrap this part up right here okay guys so what i'm actually gonna do is go straight ahead to willow creek in the next part and we'll see you guys there in the next part but yeah like i said that is going to be it for this part as usual you all have an awesome 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 day thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys next time bye bye <laughs>